at least seemingly far less hostile. This is one of the little insularis, Trimasaurus insulatus, from the Lesser Sunda Islands in Indonesia. I bet you're glad to be out of the Komodo area. You'd be uh, really good munchies to one of them big m lizards. Well, I'm sorry I'm poking you in the nose with this. Hey, bud, come on up here. There you go. There. Here, bud. You're a thirsty little guy, huh? Yeah, long trip, huh? Okay. Well, we just get over the hump here. You'll be on Easy Street. Lots of people really like you here. And we'll give you a nice home and give you lots to eat. How's that, bud? Is that okay? Alright. Stalked by an Echis Multisquamata. Here on the Echis Cam. Hi, how are you? Yes, I know. No, you can't eat this. They've uh, they've calmed down significantly since uh, they arrived here in November. Um, but these are Echis, of course. Um, these are uh, from Iran and. Uzbekistan and uh, no one's absolutely certain what sort of anti-venom might work uh, on them so it's best uh, uh, not to ar arrive at that situation and and have a need to figure it out now yeah, we'll uh, try to go in and say hello to her third one is somewhere in there. That's the one that uh, is a real picky feeder, really tough to, to get going. She's just digesting uh, two rat fuzzies. Uh, I piggybacked the second one in there and uh, uh, she really needed that meal uh, otherwise I would have had to force feed her again. And here's the other one uh, coming back around. There's a third one in here. Yeah, okay, I see the third one. It's under the, the rocks here, um, which Echis are very fond of. And here comes the big beast. Uh, she's the best feeder of the bunch. Um, She really gets hanging out there about six inches over the edge of the cage. Go on back in. Go on. There you go. Uh, interested in that camera, huh? No, 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 no. Ah, she wants to come on top of the camera 
and crawl uh, down the camera to my fingers. Although if I was very still, I doubt that I would get bit, but I'm not going to even let her give it that a try. A genus and species of that uh, snake that fellow was playing with uh, with all of his friends and carpet, but my experience with this species is it's lightning fast and uh, it's as fast and as spastic at the same time as you would you know a cobra but uh, this this snake takes no prisoners uh, this is a dangerous snake uh, and I certainly give it uh, all the respect that it requires uh, because it is fast and more often than not it nails the uh no 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 it it'll go ahead and it'll nail well okay you bit it but you normally do that uh, this snake is definitely a, a strike and release sort of animal you know, let's have a little close up of this uh, critter uh, because uh, the other guy's lighting wasn't uh, nearly as good. This is an exceptionally quick viper. Uh, you know, it's as fast a foot as as little red there, the, the old cobra. Um, it can move across the ground in a hurry. Uh, also, uh, it uh, strikes first and figures out whether it was food uh, later. Very, very uh, nasty critter. Come on. What are you doing? Huh? You better eat this before your girlfriend there uh, gets over here. Because uh, she'll, uh, she'll want to eat it. Come on. Go back in your cage. Go on. He's uh, he's one of my favorites, but I don't mess with him too much because he's very unpredictable. He's a nice, uh, well, I, I bought him from Glades. I ordered a female, and I got him instead. But uh, like I said, he's been an exceptionally uh, good animal, and uh, um, I'm happy with him. And uh, I have a female to, uh, to pair him up with now. Uh, coming out from the rocks. She doesn't belong to me. She's here on, uh, on matrimonial uh, duty, uh, hopefully to produce some nice babies. She's a proven female that dropped a few young uh, this past spring. And she's another take-no-prisoner sort of s snake, but she'll, uh, she'll grab and hold. So let's get a little zoom in here. I have to keep one eye open on uh, on the beast over there. Ye gods. Yeah. As I said, they're fairly unpredictable snakes.